Yo, what's up boys, and welcome back to another juicy drama video. Honestly, I am so triggered right now. Why am I triggered? You can probably tell from the title. I know how this is gonna go. This is so fucking weird and so unethical. After all the drama which happened for CSGO, and this is still happening, is is obscene, obnoxious, it's, it's absolutely crazy. Either way, I watched a video a few days ago from a YouTuber friend of mine, Chaboy, and he made a video on his website, G4Drop. The video was clearly sponsored, the video was clearly rigged. Chaboy, I love you, please don't hate me, but it was clearly rigged. Um, I watched other G4Drop videos and seen people who were sponsored by them, as we said in the video, and then there's a page called the Lucky Guys page, which shows the people who have made the most profit. All of the people who have made the most profit are YouTubers. This video on this website is clearly rigged. So I looked back at my emails, realized these guys sent me an email saying, do you want to get a video out and I was like I emailed him and said yeah so they gave me some money so this is a sponsored video they gave me some uh, balance as you can see in the top right and they told me specifically to open up two of the all or nothing case which is essentially a case where you can get either a dragon law a medusa or an orb safari mesh so I'm kind of curious to see what happens out of that one and then they also asked me to open up 10 covert and 5 classified I believe they told me it's through a skype message and um, that's pretty much that. So they've obviously paid for this video. So thanks to them, I guess. But this is incredibly unethical. You guys might sell, tell me um, a few months ago I made a video rigging the Dragon Law. It was actually almost a year ago now. But um, you're right, I did. And I apologize for that and I realized it was fucked up. But I'm just surprised after all of this drama with CSGO where people are still doing this, still accepting money, you know, skins from this website. I'll clearly get a decent skin, I'm guessing, if this video is rigged. Um, and also, I'm going to get, obviously, the money that they paid for me to make this video. It's weird that we'll do that after all of this drama, even though they know that it looks weird. But the thing is, people trust these YouTubers, like Chaboy and all these other people. I'm just saying Chaboy because he's the only person I personally know. But there's so many other YouTubers that people trust, and they see people make videos on websites like this, and see them turn a profit, and people are silly. They will think, I can make a profit too. Just a disclaimer quickly, but I'm not recommending going on this website and going to attempt to turn a profit. Can you turn a profit? Absolutely, you can, but odds are against you. This is a small rant I want to do just before I actually do the unboxing. But just realize, gambling, this is all of the people who've made profit by flavors. There's a lot of them, and a lot of them aren't YouTubers, but yeah. Just so you know, you know, it's obvious, gambling is there to turn a business profit, right? It's possible to win money for gambling if you're playing blackjack or whatever else, but the majority of people are going to lose money. That's how gambling casinos and all that kind of shit exists. Like, you know, in Vegas, they're pretty big and expensive because they make a lot of money from uh, people losing money in uh, their casinos and shit. So I know it's obvious, but just so you know, it is possible to turn a profit. Just like it was on steamlotto.org, that uh, website I originally made the video on for Dragon Lawn and Medusa. It is possible to make a uh, profit, but... Odds are against you. You're gonna probably lose money. This is not something these guys disclaimed in any of their videos from what I've seen. They didn't mention that the video was rigged, although it's obvious. Like, I put fucking shit on a screen where it's like, YouTuber has made a lot of profit, YouTuber made a video, it's sponsored. Like, it's it's obvious that they're rigged and that they've, they've rigged it. I don't know if they've told people, like, we're rigging this video. But either way, without further ado, we are gonna go ahead and unbox and see what happens. Because they have not told me this is gonna be rigged. I am just curious to see what happens in this. Am I gonna end up getting something crazy and I'm gonna go up... That shit crazy? I genuinely don't know. I, I, I actually don't know. They asked me to open up two of these. First one is a Safari Mesh well worn. Regardless of whether this video is rigged or not, which we'll find out in just a few seconds, we do know that clearly there was other videos rigged for these YouTubers um, for them to go back to crazy, have like crazy knife unboxing it in the title, and I just want to fucking Dragon Lord Battle Scarred. Literally. This is fucking weird, dude. These guys gave me money. These guys gave me $1,500, and I feel bad. For even making this video shit talking it. It's fucking rigged. It's fucking rigged. I just got a dragon law. Anyway, talking about some of the the, the the website's features, just quickly. But it is very well put together. It's one of the best websites to do this kind of shit on. It does have some really cool unboxing on it. Unboxings on it. Sorry, I'm just so rustled right now, I'm struggling to talk. God damn it. But yeah, it's got some really cool unboxings on it. You can see all of them right here. Um, you know, we've got reviews and shit. I don't know. This is a Facebook page, okay. Um, shit, I need to go back. Yeah, anyway, it's got reviews and shit, it's got the guarantee shit over here. Um, from what I've been told, you get your drop within about 30 seconds after um, winning it, so I'm gonna get that item at the end and show you guys it in person. And you can see all the bot live trades, like, it's it's a legit business, it's just obvious you are gonna lose more money than you are gonna gain. So already, if I look on the Lucky Guys page, I should be up here, yeah, you can see I'm right here, Size Syndicate, $389 profit, like, for all YouTubers up here for the most part. And that was just for me looking at it very briefly to work out, like, I don't know, all these guys are all YouTubers, I search G4Drop, you guys can go search for yourself, go search G4Drop and see how many of those people who have made videos saying that are sponsored are YouTubers. 
So this is obviously a profit. I'm going to send a uh, Selvis and get our money back in our wallet. So we can go open up some more cases. I'm going to open 10 of these if I was number one. But yeah, you can go look at it yourself and you realize this is just an incredibly shady business. So I've just profited, I think, a bit. I don't know. Um, but yeah, the website works very well, but it's just really weird that we do this for your sponsor YouTubers and streamers and or I guess more so YouTubers now that the Twitch term service have changed I'm just gonna sell us again, so that's number three, I think Um, and obviously rig it without letting people know and people aren't gonna say like yo, this video is rigged because it's been paid thousands and thousands of dollars Obviously depending on how big Okay, obviously depending on how big the YouTuber is Um, they will get a lot more money. I've already told you guys how much I was paid for uh, $1,500 not including the dragon law um, again, turning a profit. Like, I don't know, I've got to wonder, like, the number one dude, you can see on the Lucky Guys page, is Jogo. I'm not sure if my account's, like, perpetually rigged, if you know what I'm saying. Like, can I keep on getting good shit? Like, I don't actually know. But, uh, we'll unbox all the things that you asked me to in this video, again, turning a profit. Obviously, the valuations of these aren't necessarily, like, Steam value kind of thing, but they are, um, gonna be roughly around about that much. Uh, you can see the live feed of the top as well, where you'll see a lot of people will get a pile of shit. Um, but like I said, you can see it's like a really nice, nicely put together website. It's like, there's no denying that. But it's, I don't know. Like, you guys can tell me what you think if you want. I'm not saying all these YouTubers are pieces of sh- This is why we do this because people react and it's like shit dude, I can make profit But these people these YouTubers made a video like I've got my twitch chat open right now I'm not streaming this because I'll probably get twitch banned, but like I, I, Like dude, do we want me to say like yo guys this isn't rigged I was just really lucky like it's fucking obvious it's rigged like I don't know how these YouTubers can do this after all this drama and be like Yeah, dude like okay, so I don't know we need to open up ten of these We've, we've got the howl. We've got the fucking howl it's insane! It's fucking insanity! This is why I wanted to make a video on this website, because I did not know what to, I'm not sure my webcam just glitched out. I'm sorry if the webcam's having some issues, just moved back to England. I almost want a fire step in there. I mean, that's not really how it works. It's kind of predetermined before you roll it. But let's open up two more of these and then we'll go for the... of one, which I'm guessing that must be rigged in some way as well. Like, I think the way they do it is, um... You know how they asked me, like, open two votes, so the second one was 100% going to be Dragon Law. In this, like, the eighth one, for example, was going to be something really good. Royal Paladin, that's pretty deep. Oh, shit, never mind. I think my webcam is still glitching out. I'm really sorry about that. Yeah, my webcam's fucking up. Okay, whatever. Still, this video has a purpose. Hopefully, you guys um, are getting something out of this and realizing, like, holy shit. Do not trust YouTubers who you trust. Like, they... <laughs> Oh, not, don't, not don't trust them, but just, I know a lot of you guys are younger out there. You're like, you can use, like, G2A pay to uh, gamble on this website. Just think for a second. This is how I always do it. I think about how the business operates, right? It, it's obvious, but businesses exist to turn profit. Where this website turns profit is, obviously, they pay YouTubers and big videos, and then all these little 12-year-olds come on and get a pile of shit. Caught Sarah worth a decent amount of money there. Let's go and try again. So we've got two more of these to open up, at least according to the guys in Skype. I'll have like loads of images and shit on the screen, hopefully through editing. That's not spaces worth a lot, right? Yeah. Fuck. That's not too bad. Alright, I've got one more to open up. And then we are done. But this is, it's absolute fucking insanity, dude. It really is. Like, no one else is gonna make this video call on our website when they get paid for it, but I will. I've been there, done that, I made a mistake. Hopefully you guys know, just... Websites? CSGO websites? Gambling websites? They exist? For people to turn profit. Don't expect to, you know, if someone unboxed a knife in CSGO, you don't go unbox 10 of them and be like, wah, I didn't get a knife. Like, that's, I mean, it's different with CSGO unboxings, but I don't know why people were that upset over my Dragon Law video. I said, don't expect to go in and get a Dragon Law. Like, it's not happening. It's a business. Like, you're gonna probably get shit. Like, there's a chance you can't get a Dragon Law, but odds are you're not gonna, you're not gonna get a Dragon Law. Like, I don't know. Let's go and look at Lucky Guys quickly and see um, how lucky of a guy we are. But yeah, this website owner, I believe, or the company is Russian, like, drop it better than gaming, what does that even mean? But I am currently the seventh most profitable person who's ever played on this website, which I don't believe it's rigged over and over again, so I'm not going to waste any more of my money on it, although this was all money provided by them. But yeah, let's go ahead and open up one more covert. Like, I feel like these are normal rules right here, like, these are the rules which aren't rigged at all, and I'll probably just get something which isn't worth $8. Yeah, so we'll get this, which is, eh, it's pretty decent. If we we are going to go accept these trade offers, and, um, yeah, we'll see how quick that works, and I'll tell you guys how I feel about it. Like, maybe it's a really quick s service. Like, apparently it is really quick. You get it within, like, 30 seconds, so we'll see. 
Okay, so how do you actually take out your skins? Apologies for the chrome shit at the top, but basically this is your little UI right here. You can go ahead and sell your skins or you can go ahead and withdraw them. So you can see the ones which I've sold right here. Like you can actually go into each person's account and see what they've won, which again, website's really put, well put together. There's no denying that. We've obviously invested a lot of money because we realized we can make a shit ton off it. If we're able to throw thousands of YouTubers, then yeah, they've made a lot of money. But if I look, go to Chadboy, for example, I can go see all of the skins which he's opened, which ones he's sold, which ones he's taken. For example, we'll see the Tiger Tooth right here, which is received, and he's got in his inventory, I can only imagine right now. And just to confirm, um, again, no shade the chat boy and shit like that, but people will just say this video was sponsored. And they will assume for some reason, I think because of a Steam Lotto video, that the sponsorship is them getting the skin. No, there's gonna be money involved and skins involved. There's so much money in this business. It's lucrative as fuck. Like, they can throw money around and turn profit because people are blinded by watching their favorite YouTuber win these crazy skins, and they will think they can do just that and turn a profit. But unfortunately, it's a gambling business. You cannot do that, okay? Simple as that. Anyway, we are going to go ahead and just accept the Dragon Law and also the Howl. You can see um, it's got a trade-off right here, so it should just be able to press Receive, and as if by magic, it should bring up the trade-off there. Um, never mind. Give it a second. I mean, honestly, these systems aren't perfect. We are doing so many fucking item transactions every single second. My webcam's fucked. I'm upset. But you can see right here, enjoy your prize from g4drop.com. So we can go ahead and accept this now from Charles El Elias. It's an all-made system, and... Kaboom, we now have ourselves a Dragon Law and a Howl. I've got to wonder, after shit talking this website, are they going to try to back charge up $1,500? I don't know, but you're not getting back with Dragon Law and a Howl. Is it bad that I scammed a scamming website? I didn't really scam them, I mean, we, did, we literally just asked me to make a video on it, we didn't see it had to be positive, so we're good. Anyway, let's go and open up a game and um, have a look at our new skins we just acquired. So there we go, boys. Dragon Law, Battle Scarred, albeit, but still, it's a Dragon Law. It's worth about $550 and the Howl. I've never had a Howl before. It's pretty nice. Pretty nice stuff. So we're going to hop in game and see how we look in game. And honestly, all I can say is shame on you guys who made the videos on this website. I understand why. Money was involved and clickbait tiles were involved. Um, it's money and money and popularity. Like, it's hard to resist that shit. I struggled myself and I ended up making that video which i'm gonna apologize for but like fuck after all the drama why why would you do this anyway we are gonna go hop into a map of dust 2 and um see how you want new skins okay let's have a look at our skins so we've got the dragon law right here which you can see uh it's looking pretty decent again incredibly fucked up but still it's worth money uh, so thank you g4 drop for this like g4 drop it, it works well on what it does and like i said you can't turn a profit i'm not recommending going to it because of this shady business practice um, but you can turn a profit from a website, um, what well, the chances of that? Kind of low, but, um, it, it, it is possible, and like I said, it's one of the better websites in doing what it does, but it will try to, um, turn a lot of profit, because we need to pay for these videos for these YouTubers, so you will more than likely get a pile of shit. But you know what, it's a different trading, or different uh, gambling compared to Steam's gambling. Like, some people like these websites even though they know they're weird just because they know it's different. Like, people get bored of Steam's unboxings, I'm bored of them really. So these websites offer something different, like for all or nothing, shit like that. So, $70 to do these unboxings by the way for the Dragon Law, Medusa, or the um, Safari Mesh. Anyway, we're going to go check out the Howl as well, go on the CT side. So this is the Howl right here. No, I had Howl before, like I said. I think I'm going to take this, uh, the stickers off both of these skins, don't really like them too much. But yeah, that's uh, that's it. Honestly, I'd love to hear some feedback on what you guys think about this video. Um, should I just know I made it? Uh, is what I'm doing bad? I really don't know. But hopefully, it just brings some awareness to this. Younger people, like, I don't believe everything you see on the internet, and just think about it for a second logically. And if it's too good, or if it seems too good to be true, it probably is too good to be true. I don't know why some people like these videos by these YouTubers thinking like, Oh my god, we got a sick skin, that's so unlucky. No. It was rigged. If it was a sponsored video, it's rigged. No one's going to make a video on our website when it's not sponsored because we're going to get fucking nothing and it's going to make a bad video. And if you like watching, don't forget to comment, subscribe, and all good stuff. Check out G4 Drop. Thank you again for sponsoring this video. Thank you for the beautiful skins. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace. <laughs> At G Memes.